turkey is synonymous with Thanksgiving. Yet many people become overly stressed about roasting a turkey, which is understandable because the turkey is the centerpiece of the meal. So I'm here to share with you our simple, low and slow roast turkey recipe, which is basically fuss free and foolproof. When you purchase your turkey at Natural Grocers, you are guaranteed your turkey has never been given growth promoters of any kind, has never been fed animal byproducts, and is raised humanely with outdoor access and enough room for the turkeys to exhibit their natural behaviors. Now, when it comes time to roast your turkey, consider this low and slow method. It requires very little hands-on time leaving you more time to prepare side dishes or spend with your family and friends. And the outcome of this method is a deliciously succulent bird. For this method, I'll be using an 18 quart countertop roaster with a high dome lid, which allows for self-basting, providing a rotisserie-like flavor. If you don't have a countertop roaster, you can find other roast turkey recipes and a cornucopia of Thanksgiving recipes on our Natural Grocers website. Now let's get started. First, gather your ingredients. You'll need a quarter to a half cup Natural Grocers brand extra virgin olive oil, two teaspoons Natural Grocers brand poultry seasoning blend, salt and pepper to taste, and the optional ingredients include an onion, lemon, celery, and fresh poultry herbs. Preheat the roaster oven to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. Cut the onion into quarters. The onion is used to fill the turkey cavity as an aromatic and to provide extra flavor. Cut the lemon into quarters and just chop the celery into chunks. It's not necessary to take the peel off because the onion is used as an aromatic and just provides a little extra flavor, but you can go ahead and remove some of the peel if you choose. You have to remove the plastic clip that holds the legs together. You just pull it off. It's inside the bird as well. Now we'll pull out the, the neck. So I'm gonna empty this side. So I'm going to remove the giblet bag on the other end and now I got to transfer it to a platform to get it ready to roast. No need to rinse the turkey, just pat it dry with paper towels. You want to pat it dry on all sides, kind of lift the turkey and I'm going to cut off this little bit here which will add to the stock pot for our gravy or pan sauce. Okay, now I'm going to rub the bird with our Natural Grocers brand organic extra virgin olive oil. This olive oil is superior in flavor and with its high polyphenol content, it's perfect for the low and slow roasting method. You wanna make sure to coat the entire bird. This will help it roast and will help the skin brown. Now I'm using the Natural Grocers brand poultry seasoning blend, which is a mix of thyme, sage, marjoram, and rosemary. So this will add nice flavor. I'm gonna do the same thing on the back side. And now just some salt and pepper, including on the inside cavity, just toss a little bit in there. And you wanna liberally salt and pepper the bird. Now it's optional to place ingredients inside the cavity, but I like, again, the aromatics and the extra flavor from adding the onion, lemon, some celery, some poultry herbs also add some nice flavor. And you just place it in the inside cavity, filling it up. Okay, so the bird is seasoned. So the next step is to tie the drumsticks together. So bring it right together, wrap the twine, right below the joint to hold it together nice and snug. And then you can tie it in a knot or a bow. And then you can tuck the wings right under the bird. So you just fold the little 
end part of the wing right under the back of the bird so that you, the bird is lifted and it will also sit more even. And then it's pretty much ready to go into the roaster. Now I'm gonna lift the lid, place the rack inside the roaster with the handles up so it's easy to remove. And now the turkey just sits right on top of the rack. Ooh, it's nice and hot. And you wanna put the lid on pretty quickly because countertop roasters do not return to temperature easily. Now just leave the turkey to roast for a minimum of 10 minutes per pound. For a 14 pound turkey, I won't check it for doneness until it's roasted for two and a half hours. And again, just leave the lid on and let it roast. To test the temperature, you wanna insert an instant read thermometer into the breast area without touching the bone. When it reaches 165 Fahrenheit, it's done. Roast turkey is the perfect celebratory meal to enjoy with family and friends. Thank you for joining me today to learn how to make this low and slow roast turkey recipe. For this and more healthy recipes like it, check out our website at naturalgrocers.com.